I'm well. Aldous Hodges, did I say that right? Uh, yes, Aldous Hodge. Hodge, I beg yes. your pardon. You play the violin. You d I you, used to when you, I was, yeah. You write, you uh, yes. design watches. Yes. Are you wearing one of them? No, 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 I'm still in development. I'm All right. wearing someone else's, uh, someone else's. Uh, an associate of mine uh, designed the piece that I'm wearing. It's pretty cool. Thank you, thank you. And you grew up with parents in the Marine Corps. Yes. So, do you think that you grew up disciplined? <laughs> I grew up with uh, a great deal of discipline. I was raised in a single parent household. Uh, my mother was very much, uh, uh, very much focused on discipline and education. You know, uh, we had a good time, we had a great childhood, but when it came to education, that was paramount. You know, if we did not come home with A's and B's, wouldn't we'll go be doing nothing else, you know? But um, we had a really, you know, uh, we had great structure, great love, and the one thing I learned about uh, in terms of the military thing is my mom used to always say being early is on time, being on time is late, and I still carry that with me today. Now how'd that translate into going to a movie set in terms of working with people? Oh, well, uh, it sort of shapes up how I deal with people, how I maintain my personal self, my conduct, and how I treat people when it comes to respecting them in their space. Uh, respecting people's time is, uh, quite quite important especially when it comes to a set because everything sort of has to gel together you know the whole early is on time on time is late thing I'm early everywhere oh, that's because great. early saves a lot of time it, save, it solves problems I think <laughs> you you're know? one of the first people here tonight so yes <laughs> thank you for that today. yes there you go um, but it definitely teaches you how to respect your craft respect yourself and respect the nature of that which you're doing so that you can actually uh, continue to just maintain a degree of respect for who and what you are. Is your mom alive? I'm sorry? Is your mom alive? Yeah, she's still here. She's here tonight. Would you look in the camera and tell her thank you very much? Oh, absolutely. Hello, Mom. We'll see you in a little bit, but thank you so much for your sacrifice, for your lessons, for everything that you've given me and my siblings. Thank you so much. I love you. You were awesome and uh, straight out of Compton and oh, now you. Clemency. Yeah, Clemency. Was that a tough movie to do? Oddly enough, Clemency wasn't that tough because so we came to it with the, the aspiration to do something really uh, pivotal with our craft, you know, to give some people who maybe not, may not have the voices or the, the, the stage to say something, we wanted to shine a light on them. So we came to it with purpose. We were living in our purpose every day with this project. So it honestly was a really positive set and oh, happy. Oh, really? And, and, How yeah. about that? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I wouldn't have you know? that. Yeah, oh well, God. our writer, director, uh, Shinoya Chubu, she is really, she sets the tone. She has a, a really infectious sort of uh, energy. She She's really passionate about what she's doing. She's a lot of fun to be around because she knows what she's doing, but she knows how to have fun with it. What's you know? her name? Shinoya Chupu. And um, that set the tone for how the rest of the day is laid out. So we had very quick days. We had a great set, great crew, and we just had fun, wow. uh, which wow. may seem strange for this kind of, you know, but we had a lot Why of fun. Why not? Yeah. yeah, exactly. Well, congratulations. Thank, thank you. you so much for talking with us. Oh, thank you. Can't as well. wait to see your watches. I can't wait to see them too. <laughs> <laughs> Take no, care. Thank you. Take care. My pleasure.